Let's go over the definition of perpendicular lines. So, def of perpendicular lines. It's going to be video 0 0.046. So we'll say given or given a line such that uh, let's see we'll have a dash b dash c so we'll have a point b between the two points a and c so let's draw our line we'll have line point A, B, and C. And a point M not on line AC. So we have some other point randomly out here. I'm going to draw it up here for a certain reason. I want it directly above point B, but I'm not going to have that in the definition. We say BM, that segment, is perpendicular. to AC at point B or actually we don't need at point B we'll just say it's perpendicular if and only if the angles AB or er, the angle ABM We'll say measure of angle ABM. Actually, let's not go with angle measure. Let's go with congruence. That's a little bit more specific. So ABM, they mean the same thing. Is congruent to angle CBM. So if these right here are the same angle, then we say that these angles are, or this is perpendicular. We say, oh, BM is perpendicular to AC. Now if you notice, these look like right angles, and they are inside Euclidean geometry, but this is only a right angle inside Euclidean geometry. Only a right angle in Euclidean geometry. In other geometries, this may not be a right angle, but it's still going to be perpendicular. We'll be proving the right angle thing later on. The right angle by definition is 90 degrees, and later on we'll be able to prove that this is 90 degrees.